Hey guys, Andrew, Canine Line Adventures. We're going to have a skunk, a beaver, a red fox, a hawk eating a snake in the middle of winter, which is pretty cool. But please give us a like and a comment, as well as your subscription if you like trapping and wildlife management videos. Hope you enjoy. There's a hawk eating a snake. Pretty big snake, honestly. I don't know how big it is, but it looks pretty long. It doesn't look fat, but it does look long. It's pretty cool. Daddy, I smell poop. Daddy, I smell poop. That's awesome. Right in the front yard. Chowing down on a snake. That's awesome. Do you have any bird seeds? Mm -hmm. Alright, back on the line. Catch number 17, I do believe. I don't know. Maybe possum 5, 4 or 5. I don't know. I have to, have to look at my stuff. But Same set we had a non-target catching yesterday and uh Boston came by and checked it out I guess so all right and set out of here and uh we'll move on all right guys we got uh the trail camera right here that we're testing and I got two uh got two videos I will put them in right here of this fox that's working this set that had it had caught a couple possums and uh might have to dig it up and see um what was going on but he was seeing in one video he worked around like the back side there so i was gonna put another trap in here I reset it and reset the one I have in here have two because uh, that fox has been frequenting here but I walked up here and uh, I think I like what I see up there in the trail Got another front foot catch on red. Red, 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 red fox. Look at this old buddy. There we go. Nice long tail. You alright? You're a little feister than the last one. So I'll show you this location. There's just a little bit of a trail down here the trail there so you got several coming together I'll set that up there last year I think we caught a possum or two right about that same spot got another set in here that's untouched but it's kind of the idea put out as many these sets as you can and uh you know, we're gonna catch. So this is back the area where we had some stolen traps. You can probably hear construction equipment back there. But uh we got a pretty little fox here. He seems a little longer, I would guess he's a male, but I don't know, could be wrong. What do you say, buddy? What do you say? I love these red foxes. I want to catch some coyotes, but we'll settle for these guys. So, there we go. Beautiful. 
All right, guys, we uh, we are one passed out, sleeping up here, walking up to him, and kind of, you know, the uneducated, the antis will say how painful they are, walk up on this guy. He's probably not sleeping if he's in pain, so I'll swing you around. There's a little bit of distance here, but there's a double. Big old raccoons. Sleeping. What's up, Chief? What's up? The old boar. The old boar king. Alright. Gonna be pulling tomorrow. That is uh, catch number 21. I want to say possum number 7. But, uh, big old grunt might be the biggest one. I don't know. Backfoot catch on a monster. A monster. All right, we're down here pulling traps on this property today. It's kind of just turning into a bit of headache with uh, not great people back here. Owners are fantastic. Neighbors, another story. Anyway, um. Another possum, I want to say catch number 22 on the year. I'll have to get all these catch numbers verified. Yep. Another possum. All right, still pulling. We got number 22 here. Catch number 22. That's really I thought was going to be a good set for us. I hope we sat there for probably about 10 days or so before he hit it. I just pulled the trap up there right where that trees down the limb is down right there so i was hoping to have a coyote double here one day we just got a possum get him out of here and move on all right it's always on these uh most of these days i think that's the worst that uh something kind of cool happens and this is kind of cool probably end up being uh, a little bit stinky too but anyway um they did something else petty down here, and uh, I'm not even gonna say what it was. It's just, it's stupid. Um, in my parking spot that I've been coming back and parking in, they just did something stupid. So, tired of all their crap, but we're gonna spin around, try to be silent, and uh, let's point all these traps to go up and sit on the other place, and then yeah, I've gotta deal with this. So, I gotta go back, get the gun. I don't have my stinker pool pole whatever so we're gonna have to try to dispatch this through the lungs with the 22 so we'll see if we're lucky or not wish me luck all right I'll walk down here he's worried about getting his old hand out of that dp but skunk first one i think we're about Especially if you can't find targets. This journey last year, this year, we're like probably 60 animals in or so. Run a lot of DPs. And that's the first skunk we got. So go back, get the gun so we can dispatch it, and just learn how to uh, learn how to mess with these guys. So. All right, we brought Judah along today. And what do we got, Judah? Got a coon. 
a rainy wet coon. What do you think? Nice. All right, we'll get him taken care of. All right, guys, we had a lot of issues the past few days. Um, a lot of just, yeah, not going to talk about it, but we lost a lot of data and all kinds of stuff. So we're trying to get back on track, getting the videos up, you know, spinning around, show you what we got. Need to get uh, uh, counts back up. Don't know what we're at, but. That's right, Katie. Taking a nap. Uh, we're here. So, here we are. Alright guys, uh, you have to do me a favor and uh, excuse the wind, but uh, here we got something down here. Just don't quite know where he is. But uh, it's gonna be number five for the season. Had traps set here the last couple days, didn't catch anything. So, guess he swam down under that log. It was up on the bank when I came down here, but oh my. Much deeper if I can manipulate this log. Come on, where are you? There he is. Giver. There he is. Big old beaver. That foot catch on a 750. So grab that. There he is. Not the biggest one we caught, but definitely a full grain. So we will get him taken care of. What do you say, old buddy? Room 750. I know it's windy, but I had the elevation change a little bit and came up here and there. 